Well, as the rain falls over the stadium here at Clark Stadium, we have a big opportunity on hand for both clubs. For FC Edmonton, a chance to take advantage of the conditions, their defensive solidity, and the desire to finally find that first win of the season after pure and utter heartbreak against Valor, their last timeout. And for Halifax, a chance to make up some ground in the table and move into a tie for the fourth and final playoff spot. This is a test of the die-hard supporters. Endure the elements, put up with the rain, and watch some football. The sides they're taking to the pitch now, it is FC Edmonton and Halifax Wanderers here tonight. Match number 39 in the Canadian Premier League's fourth season. Grisius de Sola has the go-ahead, and with the skies still very much opened up, we are playing some football here at Clark Stadium. It is Halifax who kick off first. They wear their alternate strip, the gray tops and socks, blue shorts, and the Nova Scotia tartan trim. Working from left to right towards the south end of the stadium and Andreas Vakla's goal. FC Edmonton wearing the blue shirts, the navy socks, the white shorts, working from right to left towards Christian Oxner. Now show. Yeah. Still slightly out of sorts. In a formations perspective, the Eddies after the set piece. It's a quick ball in from Schaub, and the finish from Wes Timoteo. His second goal of the season. It has been all Eddies out of the gates. And far too easy. Shamit Schaub with a step on Kareem Sohn. <laughs> That was a stepping stone, but it's, again, all circles back to the issue they've been struggling with, that final pass in. Batar goes to ground, uses the back of his head to try and get it by Fernandez. Pops back up to his feet and tries a long range try. Also an early goal in that match, not quite as early as this one, but just after the half hour mark, Batar, perfect pass for Kamara, who's on it again. Settles it down into space, that second touch. Rebound back to his feet. And he just nicks it into the gloves of Oxner. He had four opportunities to pull the trigger, but Halifax close in. And he just went up to 0.42 after Kamara's adventures deep inside the area. Set piece is played in, be sane, plays it back, shown first time. Doesn't miss the woodwork by much. Yes, all that. Hey. Drafted three times in the CPLU Sports Draft, twice by Cavalry. Couldn't crack it, went back to Carlton and an impressive final season. Now he's operating as a pro. Here's Alex Marshall. Going to ground to take the space away was Niall Higgins. Alex and now his Ninth appearance of the season, his fifth start, still looking for his first point, goal or assist. Marshall again has to step on Triantafilu, gets it through his legs, spinning, turning, firing, Lamoth! Thakla, great reaction to keep it away. It's a clever little touch from Alex Marshall to get it towards Polisi. Goes out wide for Fernandez, off of his thigh, kept along the ground, Daniels now. Aiden Daniels for Marshall, Gagnon operates alone. There's the pass, the post at the back is where we find Sam Salter, and Halifax has unlocked Edmonton. A brilliant team goal, and a tap-in finish. Goal number three on this season for Salter. Halifax, they were up for it. They weathered the first storm, the first five minutes of it here. Here's Gander. That's a pretty good ball. It's on Salter! What a finish that is! Goals just minutes apart for Sam Salter. And from staring down at a deficit, almost single-handedly, the Wanderers take the lead. Timoteo, out to the back post. 
There was B Saints. He was just a few feet away from the post and he rang. Dips just before Oxner can make the save, had enough of his body in front of it to keep Batar off the ball. Nearly a full minute added to the four. It's Batar towards the middle. Batar's gonna fire, it's off target. And that's full time. Sam Selter plays hero on the road, a gutsy performance from the Wanderers.